Hi friends and welcome back. It's Mrs. Vincent with some more workbooks for you today. So today's lesson we worked on lesson 16. So you are going to need your workbook. Lesson number 16, sorry about that. You're gonna see a picture of the window. We've been practicing the parts of a window. You're also going to need a pencil and you're going to need four crayons today. Brown, green, red, and yellow. If you need to pause the video in order to collect any of those materials, please do so now. For those that are ready, we are gonna jump right into labeling the parts of a window. So our first one is for the panes of the window. You're gonna make a mark with your yellow crayon on the panes of the window. Yellow panes. Here's your second rule. It is for the lock of the window. Remember, that's the one in the middle there. Don't confuse it with the handle. A red lock. Your next coloring rule is for the frame of the window. Remember, that goes all the way around the outside. That's for your brown crayon. You're gonna make a mark on the frame of the window, brown. Now, the last part that you have is actually your missing part. It is the handle of the window. So remember, you're gonna wanna trace first in pencil, and then you're gonna make a mark with your last crayon, green. I'm gonna go back through and refresh all of those rules so that you can check one last time to make sure you got everything. We have yellow panes, a red lock, a brown frame, and a green handle. If you need to pause the video now in order to complete any of those marks, please do so now. Down at the bottom, we've been talking about a garage, a place where we have mechanics who work to fix our cars, our vehicles, okay? And our first coloring rule down the bottom there is for your brown crayon. You're gonna make a mark on all of your tools brown. Now, if you look closely, some of those tools have some missing parts. Remember, you always want to trace first in pencil and then you're going to color them. In this case, you're going to have brown tools. If you need to pause the video, go ahead and do so. My next coloring rule is for those vehicles. It is for your red crayon. You're going to make a mark on all of your vehicles red. Now, many of you got the cars, but don't forget, if it's made to take you places, it's a vehicle. That bicycle down the bottom there is also a vehicle, okay? So we had brown tools and red vehicles. If you need to pause the video, go ahead and do so. For those that are ready, I'm going to turn to the back. This is a new picture that we have not seen before. We are at a bus station. So you can see some more vehicles outside. You can also see that this is a glass kind of fronted building and that inside this is the bus terminal. Sometimes you'll hear people call it. Okay, so this is our bus station that we are at. I apologize if you're hearing my dog in the background. She wants to be let into this room. <laughs> Um, here's your first coloring rule. All of your containers are going to be yellow. If you can put things in it, it's a container. So this big one here, it's actually a set of lockers where you can store your things. So it is definitely a container. But you'll also see that there are a lot of people who are traveling via bus, okay? And they're carrying suitcases. If you can put things in it, it's a container. So I made a mark on my suitcases, yellow as well. They're all over, so use your super spy eyes to make marks on all of your containers, yellow. If you need to pause the video, go ahead and do so. If not, I have one last rule for you. It is for that green crayon. It is for those vehicles that I mentioned before. If it's made to take you places, it's a vehicle. You're gonna make a mark on all of your vehicles green. Remember, we made marks right here together, but you need to go back and color all the way. I would love it if you would also color the rest of the picture as well. You can make those pictures any color you want. So the people, you can color them, but they can be any color you want. My rules were yellow containers 
and green vehicles. Boys and girls, you did an amazing day today and thank you for spending time with me to complete our workbook. Don't forget to upload a picture to Google Classroom. And until next time, I will see you later. Bye-bye.